So currently the farm is irrigated uh, by water pulled from the underground. The underground water here is salty and we have to pass it through a reverse osmosis uh, unit. So this reverse osmosis unit separates the water into two parts. One part is uh, fresh water suitable for irrigation. The other part is saltier than the underground water and we call it brine. The brine that is produced in our reverse osmosis unit uh, is basically moved to a pool and we place our devices in this pool. Uh, water basically evaporates from the bottom side and then it goes up and it fills this uh, sphere. And when the uh, night comes, the temperature drops and then the water condenses inside and it gets collected from this, in this reservoir here. Our current prototypes allow us to produce uh, sufficient water to irrigate one, uh, one uh, tree uh, per day. We want to showcase that the technology is working and I want to, in one day, to utilize my technology to irrigate the, uh, the palm trees that I have right now. If we achieve that uh, goal, then I can grow different crops, uh, palm trees, uh, uh, leafy based uh, crops and so on. the water we produce is not suitable for drinking. Uh, not because it's not pure, because it's actually too pure. Uh, you need to add some salt to it to be utilized for drinking purposes. The water we produce is fresh and does not produce a brine as a byproduct. Traditional uh, uh, desalination units requires electricity and also requires us to get rid of the brine that we produce. <laughs> 